Hey Strikers, this is SF and the Hunter x Hunter collaboration is up and the 24 hour and 24 7 dungeon is Hisoka. So my team is going to be Murasaki, Shikibu, and Hikari, and Loki. And my friend is going to be a Pandora. Now it is relatively easy. If Even if you don't have these monsters, you can bring a ton of other monsters. There is Kali, there is Sarasvati, there is... And Mozart, there is Nostra Dumps, there is a ton of stuff out there for you. But if you wanted to do a fast run for farming purposes, then you might need some other monsters. So, uh, especially with Pandora and Loki and maybe Murasaki Shikibu. Uh, Shikari can be replaced with another Pandora if you have a Pandora. But like I said, there's a ton of monsters out there. And it's just a matter of how fast you can go for these types of dungeons because you don't want to waste that much time in farming and even though I don't even know if this uh, if this uh, team will actually be fast but from my theory it should be relatively okay so all you have to do in this dungeon is to clear off these angels these angels have a skull uh, gimmick which if they get defeated then they will do an attack up perfect and that will boost your attack of your monsters to actually deal damage to these other guys. Now, most of those angels are one-shotable, but uh, for a lot of non-dark monsters and monsters that don't have slayers, it will be a little bit difficult. So, Shikari will be Shikari will need a a power boost of some of some sort to actually get some damage done to actually one-shot those angels, but. If she doesn't get the power boost from the angel, she has she can get the power boost from Murasaki Shikibu and that should be able to one shot as well. Okay, next is Murasaki Shikibu. Now the angels do revive themselves and you have to keep out for the bottom right counter of them. That's the revive counter. So some will spawn at one turn, some will spawn at two turns. So make sure you spawn and uh, kill the ones with the ones first. Kill the angels with the one counters first on the bottom right to stop the reviving. And after that it's just kill 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 the other mobs. And that's where Loki is there for. For the, uh, for the laser to actually snipe those guys down because... Uh, what you call it? Pandora's bump combo is not as reliable and just fast clearing these guys. Of course you can also use Mozart and stuff but... Uh, these angels have have a scorpion effect on them so some of those uh, homies might be a little bit in the way and once everything's gone then the angels will be gone as well especially during the boss stages okay second uh, second mini boss and uh, Shikari so aim for the one with the bottom right with the one on it and then hopefully it'll just one shot especially with Murasaki's uh, speed up that is really really useful okay and there's one more thing and that is the Mech bird, the mech birds will shoot out gravity barriers. So if you clear off the mech birds, uh, you don't have to worry about the gravity barriers. But if you, uh, but if you can't kill off the mech birds because they are very tanky, even with the attack up, uh, just bring some minesweepers with no gravity barrier, and then that should be okay. Okay, boss stage is going relatively well, and Murasaki Shikibu is doing work, although she can't really move that fast. But with Loki, Blast Bump, it should be alright. And Shikari doesn't have the attack up, so she cannot one shot. At least I clear off the. Uh, at, least, at least I clear off the Mech Bird, that is a little bit easier for me to just move around with Loki. Oh, dang clear. That's fine. Uh, because they were both in bad positions. I was trying to get to Murasaki and just move up that way. And there is that Bungee Gum to stop my movements or just move away move my guy away but oh not enough speed for Pandora that is really annoying this is where it gets really annoying and let's hit Loki for the speed up and Loki's bomb combo can clear off those angels as well it's only the homings that they can uh, homings that there are scorpions there are scorpions but and normal bump combos can do a lot of damage to them and can one shot them. So that's why Loki is very strong. Okay, next is Loki. Although I kind of want a second Loki over a Pandora or a Shikari just so that I can 
hit the Lokis together. Or maybe another Blast Bump monster or another powerful Lock-On. That will make the runs a little bit faster. By the way, this is, but either way, it is pretty fast with this team. Okay. Next up, starting off with Shikibu. Not the best start, but either way, should be okay. And let's move down like this. Come on. Okay, I got two of the three angels, and the top one was not going to be reviving. So I'm just going to use Shikadi to one shot them, I think. I'm not really sure, but you know, that's enough damage to clear him off. And now it's going to be Loki. And just to clear off, he's so cut. What the hell? Oh yeah, I got speed down from the bungee gum. That is annoying. Either way. It's fine with Shikibu around. Now, the annoying part is coming. Let's clear off Isoka and let the angels get away from me. Okay, good. I kind of want to start with Hikari for the uh, final bar, but beggars can't be choosers. Because the last bar has a ton of mobs around. So Hikari Shakshot is main, the main reason not why I brought Hikari. But either way, let's clear. Okay, I got 2 of 3, but the angel is going to revive the angels back. But let's just clear out the mouse before I start like strike shining and stuff. Okay, there goes the angels. And bungee gum. And let's just clear. Nice, good damage. And I have Shikari for the strike shot. She is a little bit slow down, but if I hit Murasaki Shikibu, she gets that speed up, so it reverts her back, gets some speed up, and deals some damage there. That is good. And let's strike shot. I think this should be enough. I doubt it, but either way, I'm gonna use the strike shot anyways. Oh, barely. Almost enough. It wasn't a speed clear, but it was relatively close. Uh, you might need some skips for the mini boss and some good turn adjusting or just quicker shots. And there is two sh drops for it. And I heard that if you co-op, then you have a better chance of getting more drops. So, especially with the damage chest and once Hisoka dies, then there's more chances of eggs popping up. Not from the damage chest, just popping up in general. So, or in the mini boss stages. I forgot, the boss or the mini boss stages. So be sure to co-op and to get those he's so cuss. But that's pretty much it for me. I hope you guys like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. Thank you for watching my video. If you want to see more of my videos, then be sure to click the annotation in the middle. And I also have a special discount code for you on Japan Code Supply. If you want to buy some Japanese gift cards, including iTunes cards, thank you and hope to see you guys next time. Bye bye.